Ravi Wallet has officially announced their point system, which means an imminent airdrop is coming. Ravi is a new Ethereum wallet that's compatible with all of your favorite popular blockchains. So by installing and utilizing the Ravi Wallet, you'll start racking up points and your airdrop amount will become larger. So today I wanted to cover how to use the Ravi Wallet and begin accumulating points. Let's get started. So the website is Ravi.io and they do bill themselves as different yet better than MetaMask. Obviously MetaMask is the most popular wallet out there now. The Ravi is quickly climbing up the ranks and you can check out all the cool features that Rabi supports. So on the website Rabi.io, you would click on download from Chrome. This would install the extension on your browser up here. So you do get a welcome screen and hit next, get started. I do recommend you create a new seed phrase for yourself. You also have the ability to import your pre-existing MetaMask account. But personally, I would not recommend this. When you import your pre-existing MetaMask account, it would ask you for your MetaMask private key. I don't recommend that for security reasons. Never share your key with a third party. So for this demonstration, we're gonna create a new seed phrase. It's gonna ask you to create a password. Hit next. It's very important in the next screen, it's gonna show you your seed phrase. Write this down manually with pen and paper. Do not screenshot this. Do not save this on a Word document. Save it in physical paper. You can now import your seed phrase. Click on here and now manually type in your 12 words to import your account. Once you've done that, hit confirm. Cool, and this would bring you to the manage seed phrase section. So within the one Rabi wallet, you'll have several sub accounts. As a new user, you only need one address, one account. So I would recommend only adding the first one that way you have one address for the one wallet you're able to add multiple sub accounts multiple addresses to the wallet so if you feel like you need multiple address go ahead and add the rest but for most people only one address is plenty so enable that and hit done cool and now you're finally able to access your new Rabi wallet and just like other wallets you have several sections built in the wallet you have a swap section send and receive nfts transactions gas approvals to earn our free points what we want to do is interact with the Rabi point section cool and what you'll see is different ways to earn points within the wallet. You can add a balance to your wallet, do a MetaMask swap, become an Ravi active user. You can receive a valued user badge and you can also get the Ravi desktop Genesis NFT and each of those different ones have different value points. And if you have a referral code from someone say from YouTube, you can paste it here and you would earn extra points. So if you've done any of those previously, once you're ready to claim them, you would hit claim. Then you'll see the transaction message. Go ahead and sign and create, confirm. So the easiest way to earn some points is literally add a wallet balance to any of the supported chains on the wallet. So on the receive, I recommend you send yourself some tokens on any of these blockchains. So I'm going to go ahead and send some Polygon from my MetaMask wallet into the Rabi wallet. Polygon tends to have relatively cheap gas fees. So we'll click on this, copy our address. So now under our Matic chain, I'm going to click send and paste the Rabi wallet here. Cool. The amount of Matic, I'm going to send one Matic next and confirm the transaction. Great. That was confirmed. So jumping back to the Rabi wallet you do see now that our balance has increased and if you click on this arrow here you'll see our one matic available in our rabbi wallet another thing we can do within the wallet is make a swap this would also increase your points earned so under chain let's choose polygon and now we'll swap it for some usdc under amount we'll choose 0.25 we'll get quotes and rabbi will pull the best rates so by default these exchanges are not enabled so you'll have to manually click on enable it here so you can make the actual swap so kyber swap currently has the best rate the lowest gas fee so i'm gonna go ahead and hover over here click enable it you can enable kyber swap here accept the terms and conditions to confirm close this out and now click here one more time this would choose kyber swap as the preferred dex and now that everything looks good we're gonna go ahead and swap via kyber swap here it gives you a breakdown of what you're paying and what you're receiving now if you scroll lower here you can pick the amount of gas standard fast instant i like to keep it pretty cheap we'll do standard and once everything looks correct we'll go ahead and sign and create and hit confirm so now that was signed this would only take a couple of seconds to swap and now if you hover back to your wallet and you click your arrow here you'll see your new balance of USDC available 20 cents so definitely interact with the wallet as much as you can to increase your points and one more thing you can do is go to more and claim your Ravi badge and copy your address here and you click on learn more from the bank this would take you to an external link and this would be the Ravi valid user badge so you definitely want to mint this and you'll earn more points by doing this so now click on mint Log in with your Rabi wallet, hit connect, and now click on verify address. One more time, sign in, create, and then hit confirm. And now that was logged in successfully. Once again, hit mint. 
now gives you a breakdown of how to mint this badge. So it does ask you to download the wallet. We have done that already. So what we're interested in is getting the claim code. So click on get claim code here. So this would generate a six digit claim code. We'll go back to our Rabi wallet. Go to more, claim the Rabi badge. And under claim code, we'll paste that in here and hit claim and there you have it we have claimed our value user badge and again under your rabbi point section it should take about a day for these pending points to update cool and then you have it a quick forward way in how to use a rabbi wallet and begin accumulating points definitely stay up to date with everything rabbi related on their official x page where they'll announce the official snapshot and the airdrop and don't forget to check out my other airdrop tutorials on youtube there's a ton of free alpha so are you a fan of rabbi wallet let me know in the comment section and as always if you have any questions please leave a question in the comment section. I'll be happy to respond. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you on the next one.